Good morning, everyone, and welcome back. We are starting off with a download today. It is day one of a brand new week, and it is electric week, which means we are in for quite, uh, if I could hit the button, quite an interesting week ahead. But before we get there, we do need to finish up last week. There we go, happening now, electric type week. We do need to finish up last week's research though, grab our 100 sleep points, which will put us at 2,700. And then to grab our daily lottery, we can hopefully get another Poke Biscuit. A small ingredient ticket is fine, I'll take that. It definitely could be worse. And then let's jump into this sleep report um, and hopefully get something pretty interesting. See session 226 with nine hours and 44 minutes of sleep, which makes sense. I was very tired. I don't know why I've been so tired lately. All those alarms going off and I slept through it all. Sleep type was snoozing, which is, what is that, Ralts? I don't know, I always forget. And let's see, did we at least get a full eight to today for the last day? No, only seven still. Wow. Okay, so Lapis is no joke. Still only seven spawns, one a top belly and two of each of the others. So let's see, it's a Slowpoke a top belly, which is not new, I thought it might be, but I guess I got it some time ago. Hey, there's another ditto. All right. Uh, no new sleep styles either. So we've got ditto, Jigglypuff, Pikachu, Slowpoke, another Slowpoke, Eevee, and a Meowth. All right. And let's go ahead and see if anybody's hungry. No, no one's hungry today. Um... Wow, honestly, uh, pretty, pretty terrible, terrible spawns. Um, nothing really worthwhile. I'm not even worried about the ditto, honestly. I think out of all this, the only thing I really would want to try is the Eevee. Just to maybe get a good Jolteon candidate. Only plus three. Honestly, I'm not even gonna, not even gonna try. I'm just gonna save the 10 biscuits and we're gonna move on. We're going to save it and put those towards uh, Electric Week. Hopefully get something interesting. Let's see, Ditto. Is Ditto really that helpful anymore? I feel like we've kind of moved away from Ditto for the uh, the leaks. Mm, and honestly, Tails aren't that easy to come by, but Slowpoke isn't the best but you know what I think slowpoke actually is the way to go we'll send out some slowpoke candy I think that'll probably be more helpful than the other stuff we did get 2385 research XP and 3696 dream shards so not bad at all all right let's wrap it up check out this weekly summary Nice work. Area bonus is now 15%. Here on Lapis Lakeside and still we are uh, having a hard time. <laughs> Probably not going to change, honestly. Not for a while. So let's see our weekly summary for week 33. Only 20 more, well, just shy of 20 more weeks for a full year. Final strength is 463,468, which is down from last week. Makes sense. And then gains from berries up 271,056. And gains from cooking 192,412. Also makes sense since we're on an island with a much uh, smaller bonus. We did get an overall grade of S, which is good for six small handy candies. Not too bad. Sleep was actually pretty consistent outside of Friday, but we we know why. We knew that was going to happen. So that makes sense. All right. So for Electric Week, Dedene is what we're really after. Um, 
And after thinking about it and weighing all the pros and cons, I really, I'm still kind of 50-50 on which one is the best island to go to. But I think overall, the fact that we could get a Dedene probably more easily with green grass, simply for the fact that we can get to eight spawns per day a lot more easily. Uh, I mean, y'all saw we didn't even get to eight spawns on Sunday for Lapis. So I think being at green grass is going to be more beneficial. I think it will give us more potential chances for Dedene to show up because ultimately, even at Lapis, even if the spawn pool is more limited, if we only have four or five spawns per day up until like Friday, then we're really limiting the number of potential spawns. So I think it's best to just go ahead and go to Lapis. And we actually have some decent berries. We got the Mago Berry, the Bellu Berry again, which I still don't have a steel type. And then what is that? The Citrus Berry, I think? It's not the Greppa Berry. So we've got some decent stuff. We might be able to make something interesting out of this team with curries and stews, which is pretty good. It's not the best. Desserts would be better. But curries and stews are not bad. So we might be able to make something pretty interesting out of this. Let's see. Let's go ahead and collect from everybody. Because we are going to be swapping them out here pretty soon. That is a lot of oil. That is a good start. Let's hold off. We're not going to click on Blastoise yet then. Ooh, that's a lot of tomatoes too. We might have a full... <laughs> We might have a full ingredient pouch right now. Almost. We need plenty of corn. Come on, buddy. That's a decent amount. And we're full. So, I think what we're actually going to do... I think we're going to go in and we're going to expand our, our uh, ingredient storage again. Expand the ingredient pocket. I really have 1,200 diamonds? Wow. I didn't even notice I had that many diamonds. We are, uh, yeah, we're going to buy some more. Let's get a couple of them. You know what? Let's go ahead and do one more. While we're at it, let's just make a cool 500. So that should put our ingredient storage up to 500 now. So we should be in a pretty good place. Where's uh, beware? Go ahead and grab those two corn. Yep, 500. Oh, I was hoping for a skill trigger there. We're already at basic one and we're not even feeding the good berries. Or basic two, I mean basic one. What am I talking about? Come on, brain, get it together. Already at basic two, haven't fed breakfast, and we are uh, not even giving the favorite berries. So that's pretty good. Not too bad. All right. Let's see what we got for breakfast. I was trying to get some ingredients together so that no matter what we got, I would be able to make something. Dream Eater Butter Curry would be nice, but unfortunately, we don't have the pot space for that. Yep, that is unfortunate. Um, let's see, we could do Limber Corn Stew. Um, honestly though... I'm not entirely sure Limbercorn Stew is what I want to make. Although it could be very good. Yeah, let's go ahead and make the Limbercorn Stew first and foremost. Uh, we'll do that now. And then we should be able to transition to something else later in the week. Um, did not mean to do that. Let's throw in some of this oil. We got plenty. And then we definitely have plenty of tomatoes. So let's go ahead and fill it out with the tomatoes. We'll go ahead and cook that up. And with any luck, we'll get an extra tasty. That'd be nice to start the week off. Nope, no extra tasty. Okay, that's fine. We're doing all right. That's enough to get it to level 23. And that will probably be enough for like basic four, maybe? I forget. I know we were just here the week before, but I already forgot what the uh, the strength scores for the ranks are. Let's see. Plus zero to everybody. Oh, basic five. Even better. 
Basic five already for the start of the week. Very, very good. I'm happy with that. Okay, now we can jump into all the other fun stuff. Do we have any new news? Still no new news, which is not surprising. But we do have new community reports. Maybe we can hit that magical 50. 48, very close, very close. With one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve that doubled up, so exactly 25%. Very good, very good. No level ups today, but we did get three new friends yesterday. So we are now back again at the maximum cap of 50 out of 50 friends. I really hope they bump that up to 100 soon. Blastoise, you've got something for me. It's another berry. Yeah, I really hope they bump up the uh, the friend cap soon. And then for our missions, let's see. Uh, first things first. We didn't finish any of the other weekly mission. Or no, no, no. These are the new weekly missions. What am I talking about? So all of it's pretty stuff. Metapod incense, really? Okay. So we're definitely going to get that this week. All right. So for the limited time missions, let's go over these real quick. We have get Snorlax to basic two, which is a Dedenne incense. We've already got. Let's go ahead and knock it out and be done with it. And then get Snorlax to Ultra 1 for 5 biscuits. Very good. 20 Dedenne candy for Master 1. 15 biscuits gives us 5 small ingredient tickets. Use 100 candies for 5,000 dream shards. 7 incenses for 5 small handy candies. I completely drew a blank on that. And then go to bed on time three times for 5,000 dream shards and cook 12 times for five small dream clusters. So, some pretty decent rewards here, especially the biscuits, the tickets, and the candies. That's pretty good. Uh, of course, the, the Dedenne incense, everybody's guaranteed to see at least one. So that's good. Very good. Pretty interesting missions, but also kind of, kind of run-of-the-mill missions. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch on over and try to figure out what exactly we're going to do this week. Um, we have curries and stews. Spore mushroom curry is not what we want to focus on. Um, let's see. Well, I guess first things first. Let's figure out. Let's try to remember what our favorite berries are. Uh, it was Baloo, Mago and citrus yeah citrus berries okay so we do have some interesting choices we've got soybeans and potatoes we've got ginger um mm, i didn't even think about the mago berries we could drop uh espion on the team that could actually be really interesting Oh, that could be a very interesting play this time around. Okay. All right. So also, oh, Mr. Mime is 88%. Also more tomatoes and potatoes. Not super great. I think, um, hmm. I don't know. Let's see. So we've got the, the berries plugged in. We're on green grass. So I don't know why it took them away. Uh, citrus, there you are. Okay, so for our meals, what do we want to make? The ninja curry could be a decent option, but we would have to... We'd have to take the entire team just for the ingredients. But the ingredients would be easy to come by. And it is 38, that's not too bad. Spicy leek curry is also not bad. That would actually only need three team members. Uh, one of which is right here on this screen. Which means we'd have a favored berry along with the ginger coming in. Um, Let's see. The leeks, we'd have to get Dugtrio on the team. And then level it up a little bit. And then the herbs, we'd have to hope that Gengar doesn't slack again like he did last week. Because, uh, yeah, he was not doing me any favors. But I think... I think the spicy leek curry might be the way to go. It's six ingredients less than the ninja curry, but... 
think it will be better in the long run. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. I think we're going to go for the Ninja Curry. We're going to finally get the leaks unlocked with Doug Trio. And we should hopefully have an easy time. All right, so let's go strength. Mm, let's do meal coverage first. Let's see what that gives us. Generating teams, calculating, calculating, calculating. Maybe it's not going to work. <laughs> there we go. Really, nobody covers the recipes, even with meal coverage focus? I mean, I didn't figure we'd get it all the time, but I thought at least the top team would have it most of the time. Um. Oh, yeah, because it doesn't know that we have Doug Trio yet. That's why. That's a silly goose mistake on my part. Let me go, let me go get this Doug Trio real fast. Let's just go ahead and put you at level 30, because I'm going to here in a minute. Okay, now we can try the team, team maker again. Gotta plug it all back in. Mago, Citrus, Blue. Ah, oh, I didn't even save my, my curry. Spicy leeks, spicy leeks, spicy leeks. All right, five, meal coverage. Let's try again. Look at me being an absolute silly goose. All right, what do we have now? I mean, we know for sure that, uh, this guy's going on the team. Problem is we don't need him to hit level 30 because that will actually mess us up on our ginger collection this week. Um, Interesting. Both Gengars, huh? Which I mean, I guess does make sense. And Marowak, why do we have Marowak on the team? For more ginger maybe? Oh no, I know why. We have Marowak on the team because of the berries and he's got berry finder. Mmm, that's a good point. Okay. All right, yeah, let's try to run with this team. I think this is gonna be pretty interesting. I kinda need to check and see if we want Marowak or if we want Espeon, because Espeon could be very good if we get a lot of skill triggers, because with a bonus 55%, that's, what, 20, 2400, roughly? No, 25, 26, somewhere around there, every time it triggers. So that could be interesting. Let's go ahead and export to team analysis. Team name, uh, we'll call it GG Electric. All right, let's go ahead and pop over. Team analysis. Then where's that button? There is a button around here somewhere. Why am I drawing a blank? Uh, is that it? That's it. So let's, uh, I don't need you or you anymore. Let's go ahead and pull up GG Electric. Okay, so first things first, because of my OCD, I have to put Pupitar in the first slot. Where are you at, buddy? Where are you? I definitely skipped you somewhere. Uh, there it is. Okay. And then we get Doug Trio. Uh, let's see, it needs to be the 27. Okay, and let's go ahead and power him up while we're here. Ooh, do we have enough? We might have enough, let's see. Oh, the candy boost too, I forgot about the candy boost. Do I wanna use my candy boost on you though? I don't think I do, because it's not necessary. No, we're not going to use Candy Boost on him because it is limited. We can only do 50 a day. Yeah, no, we're not going to do it for him. We're going to save it. We're going to use it for somebody else. I don't know who, but I'm going to use it for somebody else. Actually, I have a very interesting idea on who we could use it for. I have a very interesting idea on who we could use that for, honestly. Ooh. Oh, it might be stupid. It might be a stupid idea, but I think we're gonna do it. All right, let's go ahead and back out. So we've got Doug Trio, Pupitar. Uh, let's get Gengar on the team. Oh, buddy, I need to give you an energy pillow. Let's get the, get that done right now, because I will forget if I do not do it now. Energy pillow. Mm 
Okay. And then we need Marowak on the team. Um, why did you go with the other Marowak? Why not this one? What does this Marowak have that the other one doesn't? Oh, double ginger? Yeah, no, I'm not worried about that. We're gonna do this Marowak. He has Berry Finder. Berry Finder, and I will be collecting from him because I do want to trigger his skill as much as possible. Um, okay. Now this is the interesting one. We might test something. I think now is a good time to test the goodest of good boys. Get herbs too with it. Ooh. For some reason I was thinking fire is what brought in the citrus berries, but it's not. Oh, okay. Maybe not. I may not do that then. Um, I don't know how this is. 99%. I need to grade this again because with ingredient finder S, I don't know how this got 99%. Anyway, that uh, kind of took the wind out of those sails. You no, doesn't make sense. Let's. Okay, let's expand. How many herbs is Gengar going to bring? Not enough. That's why we have two Gengars on the team because Gengar is going to be slacking on these herbs. Yeah, okay, we'll run with this. We'll see how this goes. Uh, that's the wrong Marowak. Let's get the right one on the team. Uh, let's see, where are you? There you are, that's the one. Okay. The leaks are gonna be the problem. Because we need... Um, where's it at? 14 per cook. Ooh, yeah, the leaks are going to be a problem. Mmm. So this is probably not going to work. We're going to have to do something else. I'm going to run it for today. I'm going to see just how many leaks actually come in. Mm, this may be a bad idea. This might not work. We're gonna try. We're gonna see. And that's all we really can do. Um Yeah, let's see, let's see if we can do a decent lunch at least. And then that way I can just collect leaks throughout the day and hopefully get the spicy leak curry for dinner. If not, we'll for sure get it for breakfast. Uh limbercorn stew, I think, is the backup for now. Let's see what can we use for a backup with this team mm, don't want to do solar power curry for the backup we do have a couple of recipes we haven't done yet uh, let's go ahead and save this team here what are the other recipes we haven't done for curries can't do that one uh, that's probably also not gonna happen but we may be able to swap to that if the leaks are looking like a problem but we still have leaks there but at least we can maybe get the ninja curry twice a day that might be what we have to do we might have to switch to ninja curry because i know we can get soybeans no problem sausage we should be okay mushrooms we almost definitely should be all right leaks that's gonna be the problem but nine we should be able to do this twice a day if this is a problem other than that oh well yeah that's all the recipes so yeah it's either it's either spicy leek curry the ninja curry or the inferno curry that we can't even do at all not even close but um i would like to do that on sunday if we can we'll just have to see how it goes but for now let's just do the backup limbercorn stew and hopefully things go well for the rest of the week because otherwise it's uh it's gonna be interesting and we could use an easy easy travel ticket but i do want to wait and save those for extra tasty there we go that's exactly what we needed Twenty-eight thousand six hundred and six. what is that like ultra 500 now 
Limbercorn stew, level 25. Where'd you go? There we are. That's a good way to start electric week. We might, uh, we might, if we get really lucky, <laughs> have, uh, a full eight spawns right at the first research of the week. That would be really good. Probably not going to happen, but it would be good. That puts us to grade three. So, uh, yeah, quite a bit of progress already. And this is why I think that green grass was the best choice for, for me for electric week, just because of how many spawns I can get. It's just more chances for Dedenne to show up, especially since base Dedenne costs seven something million. So I think this was really just the best way to go. And then we did complete some, oh, it was a weekly. I thought we had another electric week mission done, but no, just a weekly one. All right. We might even get those biscuits. Uh, those biscuits might be ours before we do research tomorrow. I just need to remember to collect missions before we get into the research. But yeah, that's uh, that's what's going on. That's what we have for this week so far. Again, we may change just to see. We're going to see how things go. We may switch it up if it's not going well. Um, I have a feeling we're probably going to have to do that, but we're just going to see what happens for now. But that is all I have got for today. Hopefully your electric week goes even better than mine has so far and we'll see what everybody gets by the end of the week but that said thank you for watching the video make sure to hit that like button if you liked it subscribe if you want to see more and until next time later dudes